So what was so appealing about the situation here in Minnesota? Well, you know, the, the, the first thing was, I think, um, their belief in me, you know, coming back from, you know, I think, you know, a situation where most doctors said, you know, Brandon Roy should be, should, should be done playing basketball. And they were excited. It was like, man, we got we to gotta make this push to, to get you in Minnesota. Shot clock down under five in the corner for three for Roy, and he knocks down the triple. You know, when you assess yourself, personally, it's up here, yeah. <laughs> you know, and now all of a sudden, if, if it's a little lower than that, how do you sort of adjust to that? Yeah, I think the biggest step was actually not playing last year because sitting there, I said, OK, look, you may not be the player you were, mm -hmm. you know, your first five, four or five years in the league. But I think the only way you can move on from that is accepting it. And when I finally was able to accept that, that's when I said, OK, now I want to play basketball. While Minnesota stars Kevin Love and Ricky Rubio start the season on the shelf, Brandon now finds himself at the center of the effort to keep the team afloat until they return. Brandon Roy with dang right in his face buried that. Is there a little more pressure on you now with all these injuries that you guys go into the season with? You know, coach, coach tells me, you know, I don't have to take that kind of pressure, but, you know, me being a, a player and a competitor, you know, of course I say I got to do a little bit more. You know, with, uh, with Kevin out, I have to take on a little bit more of the, the offensive pressure. 